My name is Gary Clumpy. I work for Southwest Public Power District in Palisade, Nebraska. I've been with Southwest Public Power for 11 years and I'm a crew chief. My experience working with steel poles, we've put in a little over two miles of main three phase line with steel poles. We've changed out and replaced single phase poles and we also have a residential area with single phase line with steel poles. We've done quite a bit of the hotline installation, replacing poles in line. Uh, basically we use the same principles as we do the wood pole. Sometimes it just depends on the situation, requires a little bit more cover up. It's very important to, to follow and proceed with the proper safety installations with a pole and the procedures and you know you take step by step. Everybody there you know has to know step by step of what's going on. We take the same safety precautions we do setting our steel pole in as we do our wood poles. The advantages are it probably frames up a little faster. I think it requires a guy in the air not to have to be up there as long. Dustin Wyckoff, uh, apprentice lineman at Custer Public Power. I've been in the trade for two years as a full-time employee and two years part-time. Uh, we set a lot of steel poles actually. We build all of our uh, T2 one odd and steel poles and all of our transformer banks and stuff like that are all steel because they're easy, easier to work with. That's the same as wood. I mean you got to take the same precautions and same thing you do with a wood pole. You know you got to cover up for what could happen and you can't take any shortcuts. So we're set up with the equipment that we can do the stuff hot. I mean, there's no difference between wood or steel with our company. We have the, we've made the adjustments and we have the equipment to do it safe. So I don't feel that, you know, it's any different. And the steel poles seem like they're, you know, lasting good. We haven't had any, you know, go down an ice storm yet. So I guess we're still good there. It's just easier to handle. Uh, my name is Wayne Haruza. Um, I work for Loop Valley's Public Power out of Ord, and I've been in the trade about 28 years now. I've done everything as far as setting and framing the steel poles, two-piece poles, setting them, transmission poles, covering up the, the line, pretty much just do the steel about the same way we do a wood, um, as far as covering up the line, um, tagging everything off, um, covering up the pole in certain situations, really no different than with a steel pole as compared to a wood. <laughs> 